Hello guys, welcome back to another food fantasy video. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. So normally I start my videos as a summoning video, typical. I am already in the game. However, this time, since I am now out of school, I had a chance to come in fresh into the game, not having looked at anything yet, and I'm just going to go right ahead and explore all of the new events. I'm not going to read anything. I never read anything. I don't read any details um, other than like this. Let's see. What do we got? Figure out what everything is as we go. Okay, we're going to go ahead and just go into the game now, I guess. Uh, I have no idea what to expect. I never do when I do these events. I don't prepare for them in any way. I don't know why. I just don't feel like it. Uh, so, Endless Adventure. During the event, summon to exchange for tons of food soul shards. That could be interesting. I don't know, it has, it has a picture of a, a squirrel, so maybe we can get her again. Um, we also have yummy refreshments, so we just get free rewards, that's cool. We have Mapo Tofu, obviously, um, and her skin, I think. And I don't, I'm not sure what this is. Bright Moon, special illustrations. All right, we'll look at that. Special Dine and Dash, uh, the Neon Beast will appear with a chance of changing into a special Dine and Dash incident. Okay. This is the skin, I think. Chase, rack up New Year's money. Oh, this is this is all like new kinds of stuff. This is, this is nice. And then we have a good chance of getting butter tea. All right. Tons of URs. This is a lot. And 10 times guarantee UR card pool. I saw this somewhere. So we obviously have a lot of things going on here. Uh, I'm just going to look at it one by one. So, this is something that's going to take me somewhere, so I'm not going to do that. Um, oh, what is, what is this? Let's see. If you collect all the illustrations, hmm, increase by one afterwards? Does, this, does that thing upgrade after? Maybe I should read this. Every two hours, you'll get one event chance. Um, Every time you get an illustration, you'll share it. Okay, so in two minutes, I can come back and I get one chance to draw. That's neato. So this is just a time thing. That lasts 19 days. Weird. Um, when you top up to start... Oh, this is gonna... Oh, oh. Yeah, this isn't gonna happen. <laughs> this is not gonna happen. That's a lot. No. Th this is huge, massive whale hours. No one is gonna be getting this. <laughs> I am certainly not going to get the skin through that method, if there even is another one, hopefully. Um, this looks like, this looks like one of those, um, events that you, you go through the story missions, so, it looks like they're giving us some items from that, and, oh, not these things, oh no, I'm getting, I'm getting flashbacks, this is bad. <laughs> At least we are given some, some embers to start off with. Uh, Endless Adventure. Each time you do a summoning, you will get a summoner note, and you can exchange it for Mandarin Squirrelfish. So we will be able to get Mandarin Squirrelfish and um, a new avatar. That that looks that avatar looks really cool. Uh, what is this? What? What? I am. There is so much new stuff, and I, I'll have to read it all later, more in depth. Uh, what is this? What does this take us to? Oh, it's a story. So it's talking about the beast, the legend, who owned the the um, legendary fallen angel. Okay, that was a very long story. <laughs> that was very long. Um, uh, is this like a? This is definitely a pizza thing. There's way too much to read here. Uh, so I'm just gonna take a look at it because usually I can just glance at it. Uh, total ten beasts in order to get Mapo Tofu and this Spring Beast Avatar, which is going to be cool. And these are just some extra rewards. So th this is definitely um, a pizza thing. I don't have to look at the card details right now because I'll have plenty of time during downtime. So here we have the pizza-esque rankings. It's basically pizza. Um, uh, it's looking like you're going to have to rank really well to get the skin. Is there is there no way to get the skin? Oh no, it comes with rank 1 through 50. Okay. So this is literally a pizza thing. And then, yes, here's all the story. So we don't need to look into that now. We have other stuff to do. Although we probably should get that out of the way so that we can not waste any time. But I don't know. I have I have lots of stuff to do. 
I have refreshed my fallen angels. That is done. I need to do one of these before it goes away. Let's find an easy one that I already have some stuff prepared for. I thought it would be interesting to make this kind of video for people who have never seen someone else go through all of their daily stuff. Um, I will also have a summoning video coming up shortly after, but this is just how I go through the process. I always have some stuff set up like this that I, I just go for first, because uh, it's just all ready and nice. I'm now replacing all of the explore missions that I have used because I have a lot of extra slots that I need to prepare for like later or tomorrow or whenever, depending on how much I play. These are just some extra items to get. It doesn't really require me to do it every time, but if I get a lot of them it helps build up some, some like uh, seasoning and um, other things that I need like shards for fusion and all that. I usually put off the guild because it doesn't have like a specific timer. We're gonna check out the fishing hole because it usually needs a lot of keep upkeep, you know? There's, there's always a lot of resetting that happens in here. Uh, I always activate the wish right away. I usually change up the order of the stuff that I do all this in so I don't get bored of just doing the same thing because if I followed a route it would it doesn't really slow me down not following around but like you know it just keeps it interesting i do need more of these i hope you could get i hope there's like a um like the clown thing that pizza's event had in this new one i didn't i didn't even open it yet i probably should and right now i'm grabbing all all the strawberry daifuku shards because i don't have her i have all the other uh, m souls maxed so she's the one i'm prioritizing I'm trying to get as many of hers as possible. Um, is there a dine and dash I can do? Doesn't look like it. I will probably have to wait. I will have to wait for a dine and dash. Um, I also always do this, even though I don't need it anymore, because I have like I have so I don't even know how much that is. I think it's like it's either 50 million or 500 million, but it's it's way more than enough to get anything I need. Let me do some guild stuff real real fast. I always do everything. So let's look at the summoning. I'm not going to do anything yet. Um, summon ten, consume 10 gold bricks. Hmm. What? During... Okay. Only 10 draws are allowed in this limited sale card pool. Each draw costs 10 gold bars. Oh, I see. Each each 10 will give out a random UR. So let's check out these golden bars. So each so if I wanted if I wanted 10 golden bars, that would be this much, which is basically 30 summons. So for three times the price, I can get 10 summons with a with a guaranteed. SR. Also, it pulls from this pool, and so there's no rares. So the others will be very good as well. So this is a solid option. It's looking nice. I can get Milt Cavi. I I could even get Toso. That's really cool. Um, and I could also get Buddha, which I don't have Buddha's Temptation. So I could get a better caviar. I could get Toso or Buddha for the first time. Um, I also could get green curry. I don't have him. Um, and I also could get... I could get, um, strawberry. And that would be enough to ascend her because I, I think I have 10 shards left. Then we have this... this event came back. So, for 12 more days, I have a chance of getting anyone from here, which is nice. I could get green curry again. Um, I could also get... Toso. I, I have a chance of getting her. I, I could get Toso. So I could get Butter Tea, I could get Toso, and I could get a Caviar and Milt and all of these, and that's crazy. Um, but I know how this one works. This one you have to, um, you have to just do a lot of summons, and then you get, you get the cigars. You, you can't buy them. So in this pool, I can get, like, pretty much everyone. There's, there's all the people listed before. I can also get rares 
and all, it's just everything. It's it's a mix of everything. So this is a good pool. This is a very good pool. I haven't checked probabilities yet, but it, it's a good pool, and I will definitely get green curry. So I should I should waste some of my embers on this so that I will indeed get green curry. Uh, the rest will probably end up in here. It's looking like. And then Mapo is an event, so I'm not going to waste my crystals because I need them for, for Mapo. Uh, I always waste my stamina so that I can start regenerating it again. So I'm going to spend it all on airship and probably review. I'm also going to use it on. I'm also going to use um, some stuff here so that I can get this done before before I do review, so that I don't accidentally waste all my stamina. I make sure to also come and do a hard level because that is one of the dailies. And then I grab the stamina from that. At this point there's no there's no other thing that requires me to waste stamina. So I can just go back and waste the rest on whatever I need. So normally at this point I'd be done since I have most of the the um the non-waiting game things out of the way. However, instead of doing trials or the disaster or something something along those lines, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the Mapo Tofu event. Oh, here we have we have now gotten um, one of these, so I'm just gonna do it, just see what it does. Um, I have no idea. So after sharing, listen to the Food Souls story. Okay. Okay, I have now unlocked this picture. The other ones I haven't. So once once I unlock all of them. It looks like I will be getting this and this and that, which are all excellent rewards for just coming up here and sharing all of these amazing pictures. So what is this for? Anytime you summon something, you get things. So I could get this. I don't remember the other place I saw that, but I saw that somewhere else. I can get these, which I will probably end up doing. Um, I, I obviously want this. Maybe maybe I'll end up getting a Mandarin Squirrelfish to... Um, five star because she's she's popping up all over the place and then an item used for breaking golden pigs I don't know what that means I don't know what that means we're gonna go ahead and look at Mapos now like I said okay we have com we have completed that story so we have this spring arrival we have this we can buy six purchases each one is a hundred so it's just the pizza event and we have this golden pig which I'm assuming is yep Okay, so we will get Lion's Head from this. Um, that is cool. We can exchange these. Oh, these are the things to, br to break the Golden Pig. I understand where it's coming from. So you can, if you do summons, you can get extra chances at this. Otherwise, I'm assuming you have to get them from the other method, which is playing through all the stages. So that's cool. You can get some through summoning as well. There's going to be a lot of extra... Um, soul embers and crystals that you can obtain through this. I'm actually thinking about skipping these days. These. I'll, I'll get these of course because I need um, I need I need lion's head obviously because I'm I'm trying to collect a lot so I will go for that but if I ever don't need these days I'll skip them because I already have enough of this stuff. Uh, it would be really nice if I got like these three and not these and then I could just stop with a bunch left and save. So we're gonna go ahead and look at the actual event itself. We have a story. Okay, that that is now out. That is now out of the way. We have summon, summon the beast. Oh, you can summon it by using by. F okay, so I understand what this does. This all links back up. You can get the beast by going into the place and having a chance at getting a firecracker. I think. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay. I see what's happening. So yes, this is this is a pizza-ish event. It is not anything like Turkey's was. This is definitely exactly what pizza's is. So if you were here for pizza, this is the same pattern. Um, you do the same kinds of things. Obviously, if you're not going to to buy any stamina with with crystals, you're just going to want to waste all of the free stamina that you get. Okay, so we have the we have the boss appearing. Um, so you do get an envelope. Yeah, I think you get like five or something every time you do one of these. If it's the same as pizzas. So I'm going to have to try to figure out the best way to attack this beast for me, personally. Um, let's check out the boss details. So he raises his attack and defense. This is 
Okay, this is literally the same boss. Okay, so it's gonna work the same. You're gonna want to go for pretty much. You're going to want to go for pretty much the same methods you did before. It's this. It works the same. It's a big grind. It's a big grind. But it should be worth it because you should be able to get something at least, hopefully. All right. Well, that is me exploring pretty much all of the new events. I believe I covered pretty much everything. I think I got every event. Not sure. Um, I will do a bit more research and do some summonings and hopefully I will be entirely sure that I've found everything. But so far we've got some what well, looks like new restaurant things. We've got the, um, the obviously the big event and some summoning events. And some free stuff which you can log in and get whenever. This has been Dissectionator. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know. Um, do all the great things that you can do to help me out if you so desire. And I will see you all in another video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.